Hey everyone, this is Frosty, and today I have a Zerg vs. Terra battle for you guys to watch, so if you'd like to leave some comments, that would be great, because I would have liked to know what you guys would have done in this situation. Um, so besides that, I thought I'd let you guys know that I am in gold still, and I'm doing actually pretty well. I'm winning a lot of my gold games, so I'm hopefully going to be boosting up to platinum soon. And besides that, uh, that's about it for today. So enjoy the commentary, and I'll see you guys very soon. Hey everyone, this is Frosty, and today I have a Zerg vs. Terran battle for you guys to watch on the map Steps of War. So here we have Sore Lion, the red Terran player, in the top right hand corner of this map. In the bottom left hand corner we have me, Frosty, the blue Zerg player, so I'm just going to be sending my Overlord out to scout the ramp of my base, but I'm probably not going to see too much but a ramp, so it's going to be probably really boring. Currently, Ah, uh, we're exactly even on Harvester, so seriously, nothing happening right now. Maybe I should speed it up. I'm debating it, but maybe I won't. I'll just sit here slowly. Um, so right now I'm one Harvester ahead, but it looks like he's about to catch up here, and there we go! He's just even on Harvesters now, but his um, SCV has decided to build a supply depot while my drone over here has decided to come and scout his base. Now let's follow this drone on his adventure into the enemy base. So here we go, he's crossing something that looks somewhat like a bear, but it's clearly not a bear. I have no idea what that creature is. If it does have a name, please tell me. Anyways, here we go, I'm up in his ramp and I am seeing not too much. It looks like he was wanting to attack me, I'm not too sure, I decided to attack him. But instead, I'm going to be going in circles because it's more fun. Um, yeah, that's about it, currently. It looks like he has two SCVs, one SCV after me, the other SCV has decided to build a barrack, so that's fine, I'm just going to keep circling in my circles. Um, but it looks like second SCV has decided to join the fun and attack me as well, but he doesn't really have the chance to attack me because we're exactly the same speed. It looks like here he has his first supply depot, or sorry, his first refinery going up in his base, and besides that, not too much is going on. Over in my base we can see that I've got my extractor going up and my spawning pool. So we're even on harvesters. This game is looking pretty even right now. Nobody's ahead I'd say. Um, so yes, there goes his gas and he's already started harvesting with that one SCV. wonder when he'll get a couple more out. But anyways, I'm just going to keep going in circles because circles is fun. And it looks like he's going to be pumping out his first marine there, and it is targeted right on me. He's actually going to be getting a second gas here. Oh, he's not getting a second gas. Never mind. He was thinking about a second gas and decided not to go for a second gas. I'm not too sure, because I was able to see that. So maybe he decided to not show me that he was doing gas. See, I'm not too sure what he's doing. It makes me think he's like trying to hide doing banshees or something. So that kind of worries me a little bit, um, but hopefully I can get this drone out, we'll see! No! He has decided to get a second marine out and shoot me from the front of his base. So over on my base we can see that I have finished my spawning pool. In production I have a queen going out, and it looks like this guy over here is deciding to make a second base at my natural there. and. I'm kind of worried right now about possible banshees, so I'm probably going to be getting that second gas out pretty quickly, so I can get the, um, so I can get my layer going pretty quickly here. But we can see here he's actually going to be building a bunker and a second supply depot or third supply depot actually, and he's actually decided to go for that second gas. So this is uh, interesting. He's going to be building a factory. So I think you need factory before you get a star port, so maybe he's going for, you know, the Banshee attack. We'll see very soon. Um, so besides this, all he has is three marines in that bunker, so he really doesn't have too much of a force. But I have, like, four Zerglings, so I really don't have that much of a force either. I have my layer going up, and that's about it currently. So over at his base, we can see that he's just pumping out some more SCVs. Uh, let's look at income right now. He has 20 SCVs compared to my 17, and his factory is almost done. He's still pumping out a few more marines here, and looks like my zirkling is going to come and scout, but all I will be able to see is supply depots and a barracks. That's it. So not too much information coming here, but it looks like he's actually going to be making an armory, so it looks like we're going to be seeing some early Thors in this game as he's getting that tech lab onto the factory. And currently I'm going to be putting up a spire because I am anticipating some early banshees because I can't really scout anything 
uh, at this moment besides what I can see right here. Um, I'm not too sure how I would see this, maybe if I sent an overlord out, but overlords are so slow, so I'm not too sure. Maybe um, an observer would have been get better. Actually, that would be an overseer. But he's just putting some supply depots around his base, which is good, because um, <laughs> it's nice to use the nice one when they don't um, take advantage of that. Anyways, his armory has finished, and let's see, he is producing one Thor. Alright, so this is kind of scary here. Uh, here comes my Zergling. It's not going to run up quite yet. Hopefully it can wait to see the Thor that will be coming out. Um, but he does have a few, quite a few Marines, and it looks like he's actually going to be researching the upgrade for Terran Vehicle Weapons Level 1. And over my base, I just only have a few Zerglings, not too much here. I have one Queen down there. Um, my Spire's almost done, so I'll probably be able to pump out four or five, um, Mutilus. But it looks like that's not going to do too much, because he does have a Thor out right there. And if I ran up here, I'd probably be able to scout that, so hopefully I scout that pretty soon. Oh, here we go. Alright, so I pretty much scouted that Thor right on time, and, uh, I can now, well, I've already got my five Mutas in production, so I'm not really going to cancel them, because I have lots of minerals, so... There's no point in cancelling them, I'm just going to do probably a little bit of harassment, and he's actually going to be coming out with a ton of marines and SCVs. So it looks like he took at least half of his SCV force and decided to uh, come in... Oh no! Alright, so I've decided to go into his base with my mutas, and hopefully he's, hopefully he's going to run back, because I saw the huge force of... Um, Marines and a ton of SCVs here. He has at least 10 SCVs probably. So I'm just going to try to be pumping out as many Zerklings as possible. I'm going to be getting Bailing Nest so that I can blow up some of those SCVs that are surrounding him and healing him currently. So my force doesn't look too bad right now, um, except for the fact that he has all these SCVs so he could probably kill me off, kill me off a lot faster. Um, but yeah, I have all this larva sitting here. I don't know why I'm not producing anything. I guess I'm just so worried, maybe my mutas, I'm trying to control them. I don't know, I've just decided, no! Okay, so I got two marines, but I'm going to be backing off now. I have my three bailings morphing in, probably not the best place to morph them though, and those are probably going to be blown up quite easily and very soon. So I've decided to go in for attack, um, just a click, really, because i got to get kill off all those SCVs before really attacking the Thors. And this is not looking good at all, because he still has how many? He, I don't think he lost a single SCV there. And this is pretty much looking like game. This is an all-in attack. I've killed off all his, um, oh, he's decided to build a command center there. Interesting. But yes, I've killed off all his SCVs besides the ones that are just surrounding these three Thors now. And this looks like it's game because I just don't know what to do. I didn't get my bailings out quite in time. And let's just attack with all the drones and get blown up really fast. Um, so that was a very interesting game. I'm not too sure how I should have taken that. I thought he was going for Banshees, but apparently he was going for Thors. So let me know what you thought in the comments about what I could have done better in this game. And thanks everyone for watching.